Hello everyone, and this is Caden with JK Gaming, and welcome to another game, game exposure video. I'm going to be doing Ether 1. I know nothing about this game except it's on the Unreal 4 engine, and it, it looks fascinating, I believe. If I read, I think it was the people who made No Man's Sky, no Man's Sky or are making No Man's Sky, that are making this, but... I don't think I'm right. I'm second-guessing myself. Tell tell me in the comments, because I know they made another game recently. It's, um... That's enough of me trying to explain something I know nothing about. Let's get started. Uh, I only booted it up to see what the game would look like. So, start new game. I'll overwrite that. I yeah, as you saw I literally played for a minute. <laughs> All right, let's get 15 minutes into it this time. Well, a little less than. Hey, it's me. Listen, I I'm sorry for the things I said earlier on. It's just. God, I really don't think you should go to that place. I, I, don't, I, I don't think they care. Would slow down. Not like they should. And before you think it, I know how it feels to want to feel safe, to want more. You know I do it. But Jesus, do, do you know how I view you? Just another patient to squeeze money out of. Please, don't go tonight. I'm freaking scared. For you and for me. Press square to interact. The game looks good. Looks really good. Ethereal rock. In the mid 19th century, advances in genetic and psychological sciences led to a series of astounding breakthroughs. Keeping your fondest memories the alive. Genome. At the forefront of these experiments, I don't feel like listening to that. Ding. Is that? It is. Oh, this is excellent. We're so glad to have you back. My name is Dr. Edmonds, but Where are you? you can call me Phyllis if you like. Phyllis. Ha, right. Phyllis. There should be a the reception desk. So once you've signed in, grab the key card from the top drawer and head on down. You will need it to gain access to the lower floors. I D E D E N That's the wrong button. That's a jump button. What is today's date? I think today is the 25th. Stop pressing jump, stupid. And it is currently... I'm recording this at 6... 33... AM. Alright. I didn't hear what else I was supposed to do. I go through the door. What about this door? I'm gonna wander over here. This door? Hello, stuff up here. Best prank yet. Hey James, I'm totally set up the greatest prank to get McCarthy back this back this weekend, especially after what he did to my sandwich last week. I found out what he always that he always works late Saturday evenings, so usually on his own 
usually on his own on maintenance with restoration chamber number three. You're not going to believe what I've cooked up. I replaced the fuse with, in the Rembrandt power box with the wrong type. When McCarthy comes to do the power check on, on the chair, he's going to make a huge bang. He's going to be scared to death. I don't know if that's a good thing. Music. I don't know what I'm doing. Button? Oh, I can't go that way, apparently. It doesn't like me. Ready? Load Ether Solution 3.5. Loading. Ready. Ether Solution 3.5 suspended due to insufficient data regarding health and safety. Ratio of positive and negative effects upon consumption is currently 1, to two, 1 out of 2. It is worth noting that the current positive effects have shown the intended outcomes of this experiment clearly. Positive effects include a stronger, more, more defined focus in patients as well as stronger cognitive skills. Negative effects, however, have shown serious problems in, to the consumer, in some cases causing further short-term memory loss. Well, that's no good. I saw something... Yeah, maybe I didn't. I'm gonna try this door. Offices and gallery. Can't go that way either. It's, I feel alone. So very alone. What was I supposed to do? I don't remember. Somebody help me. I'm sorry, guys, if I can't figure out what I'm supposed to do. It's my own fault for not listening. But... Restoration procedure for patient... J N two zero five seven. Will commence shortly. Staff are advised to prepare chambers for initial projection. Does that mean well, I can go through these doors? There's plenty to do, and for you, plenty to see and discover. I'm going to be guiding you through the process of restoration this evening, and hopefully the ensuring restorer, that nothing terrible happens to you or our client. Evolution, an asset to I'm society, in restoration and chamber number three. Now, if you don't mind, would you be a dear and head on down? Yes, ma'am. Yes, Phyllis. Industrial mining. Okay. Well, I might do a two part for this just to figure it. Hello. Go back this way. Oh, it doesn't unfog. Damn. Is this the right spot? That ain't working. another key card here. I'm going to take this one, because I like this one. I'm going to take that with me. Restorers may only carry one item at a time. Hmm. I think I'm going to have to do a two-part episode here, because this ain't uh, very clear yet. Beep. She said number three, right? Yeah. Figure out which one. It's not like I'm gonna sit here and mess with it. I'm sorry, I'm messing with the mic real quick. Having some uh, technical difficulties. Uh, ah. Sometimes these procedures don't. Uh, how should I put it? Go to plan. But really, there's nothing to see here anyway. Shouldn't you be heading to restoration chamber number three to meet me? If I knew where it was. I wish someone would tell me what direction to go in. Is it in here? 
Hey, there's lockers. Nondescript pills. <laughs> Ice bourbon. Okay, let's try the other door. The offices and all that, blah, 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 bull, bull, bull. There we go. You sent me free roaming through the facility. You can't expect me to know what you want me to do. Crouch. I hide in here. It's a hidey hole. Haha. -ha. Beep. Cognitive psychology. That's a plant. I want the plant. I can't carry the plant. Ready. Load report. Projection. Malfunction. Loading. Ready. Due to a bad projection, R156. Uh, you know, we do tell them not to leave the pre designated path, to stick to the memory routes laid out for them. But do they listen? Of course they bloody well don't. And unfortunately, recovery isn't always an option. Once you experience the deep recesses of another consciousness. That was confusing. Anyways, due to due due to a bad projection, R one fifty seven has suffered severe hemorrhaging in the brain. This has resulted in a minor stroke impacting our patient's motor abilities. The investigation is still underway, although evidence points to a fault within within the cerebral component of the restoration chair. Patient R157 is currently in the recovery chamber. Depending on po upon treatment, may have sustained damage due to memory functions. That's no good. This makes me not want to do this. Why am I doing this? I don't like this. Sorry about the train, everybody. It's coming through. And it's going to be a little loud. Choo-choo. Yeah. I live with that every day. Doesn't bother me anymore. It's been over a year. Anyways, I'm going to actually end this video early before we get into anything more. I'm sorry this was such a roaming video. Uh, not a lot happened. Um, the next one, I promise, will have more. This is going to be a two-part at least. I may continue depending on how well this goes. Um, for now, thank you for joining me. This has been Caden with JK Gaming. And this has been Ether One. Again, fascinating from the looks of it. Very slow to get into, apparently, especially because my character walks slower than dicks. But anyways, thank you for joining me, and I'll see you in part two. Ta-ta for now.